Alright, hey, what's going on you guys? Jeff and Christy, and we have headed out to uh, the Eastern Shore with our buddy back there, that's John. What's up, John? What up? Uh, you guys, we are going to be trolling for Spanish mackerel today. Uh, hopefully We're they hungry. are... We are super yeah, hungry. We're trying to fill our bellies hungry. today. <laughs> So hopefully we're going to be filling our live well here, uh, just an hour or two getting out here. Hopefully we'll be getting on them. Uh, and then we're also going to be doing, what else, Jeff? Who knows what we're going to get into today. We're going to try for Spanish first, mm -hmm. because that's a species that we have not done for y'all yet. Yeah, I so. have not targeted those uh, for our one fish, two fish video yet. Yep, usually yeah. we're more of casting and kind of the shallow water inshore type fisherman, fisherwoman here. <laughs> but we're usually not really big on trolling, but for the Spanish mackerel, that's the way that you kind of target them out here in the Chesapeake Bay. That's a very popular way, so we do want to showcase that. We want to show you guys how to target Spanish mackerel, how, yep. to, how to catch them, how to slay them. So check it out, y'all. I got my Hawaiian shirt on today, and it's all about the good vibes because good vibes correlate to catching more fish. That is my belief. Dude, I'm seeing bait busting like crazy up there. You are? Or fish busting on bait. Whoa, look at all the bait. Yeah. You aren't lying. Whoa, got one. Woo, fish on. Yeah. Nice fish too. Nice. Is that a mackerel? I hope so. Woo. Yeah, buddy. Oh, that's a nice one. Ready? Get up, get up, get up. Woo! Nice. Dang! Oh, no. That is a good Spanish that's mackerel on the gotcha Jeez. plug. Sweet. Woo! We were talking about yes! I knew we'd get one there. Woo! Nice. I'm so pumped. Yeah. Nice catch. Nice. Check him out, you guys. Woo! This beautiful Spanish mackerel. Just got him on a plug. So fine. These things are awesome. He's got some mean teeth. And as he was thrashing around on the boat floor, he was like, all these little minnows were flying out of his mouth. Woo, that was a freaking rush. That's awesome. Such a cool fish, you guys. So fun. Are we gonna keep this guy? He's definitely yeah. keeping size. Yeah, we're keeping him, put him in the live well. Yeah. He's he gonna make a ton of fish tacos tonight. That's probably six tacos right there. All right, cool, throw him in the live well. Okay. Woo, yeah. Dinner, baby. Oh my God. A shark. Woo! Oh, I got one. I got one. Here we go. Yeah. Put it in, put it in. Oh! Yeah. It's pull and drag. Ooh, dang. Oh my gosh. Woo! Nice. This is a mammoth one. What is it? What is it? Oh my god, it's a big one. Is it? Woo! Nice. Dang! Alright, keep it on, keep it on, keep it on. Holy shit. Take the drag, take the drag, take the drag. He saw go. the boat. Not too much, not too much. Ooh, there you go. saw the boat, didn't lie. Like, there you go. Nice one. Woo! I got the boat, John. Good one. All right. You want to help flip him in or try to... Oh, my! Whoa! Oh, it's no, a... No, don't flip it in. Hold on, hold on, hold on. John's got it. John's got it. You got it! Woo! Yes, baby! Give me some life. Oh! You guys, check out this Spanish mackerel. I am freaking out right now. Dude, this that thing. That's a good Ooh. citation. Ooh, all right, that should I get a <laughs> Check out this Spanish mackerel I just caught. This thing is a hoss. That was such a blast. He could have easily spooled me. He went on a really big, strong run, but got him into the boat and landed it. Thank you to John. Dang, you hold guys, him up a little bit, John. Awesome. <laughs> Get in there. Crazy! That is sick. That was awesome. This thing is crazy. Super, super awesome, strong fighting fish. <laughs> so cool! Props to John right here. Yeah. Yep. Wow, right this here. Thing is bloody Dude, found that out, man. That is <laughs> awesome. For the so, viewers, what do, what do we got? What do we got? So we're using a this was made by C Striker. So C Striker, these are yeah. what? Like, what is it? Number one planer? Number two. Number two planer. Yep. So what's what the pound test is this main line? This main line is probably like 30. 30. Yeah, that and this probably 20 right here. So 30 pound mono main line. Yep. Just regular trolling conventionals. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then I got, I don't know, maybe 
20 feet of 20 feet of leader line with the like, uh, probably 20 pound test it looks like 20 pound test and a clark spoon 20 pound test and this is what this so this is what does the magic pretty much well this one's not going to do it today it's yeah a new hook. Right, right all there. right so this right here this is the money maker so this is just the clark spoon right it's just the clark simple clark spoon it's the uh basically the cheapest one they got it doesn't have any fancy stickers on it it's the smallest one they have yeah so yeah that's pretty simple and it's about you said 15 to 20 feet of leader line is what you use off the number two planer yeah uh off the number two planer yeah planer fishing okay this is if it's like in line like this that means it's tripped right so it's not gonna it's not gonna take your line down this ring has to go up to that the top of that okay so again, so if the ring is down there, that's no good. Right. You want the ring up there. Yeah, and you'll see the, the angle of the line going straight down in the water. Okay. If the angle of the line is going right back to the, the, to the surface of the boat. Okay. And that means you might have a fish or it's just something tripped it. Okay. So what happens is this planer will bring will bring the line down, your main line down, actually, the, the yeah. entire rig down. Right. When a fish hits it, it's going to go like that. Okay. And this is actually going to help you bring the fish to the surface and fight it, fight it in easier. So this is going to keep this line down. You said about 15 to 20 feet, right? I think about 15, 20 ish. Yeah. Okay. All right. So when the fish hits, it's just going to be like this. You're just going to see that. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Woo! First Spanish of the day. We're just hand lining them in. Catch and cooking. Nice. Okay. All right, you guys, just caught our first Spanish of the day. Beautiful. Not a bad size. Really pretty looking fish. Chompers. That is serious. Cool stuff. Nice. Spacos. That's how it's done. That's a fish. That's a fish. Double it up. Double it up. Yeah. I got one. I know I do. I feel them. No, sir, that's Spanish. Oh, dude. Woo! Perfect. Good job. Jeff just got out his first Spanish mackerel ever. 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 Woo! Put him in the wide right ground. All right, y'all. So it is about that time. The sun is going down. We have plenty of bluefish. Some we're going to eat, some we're going to use for bait. <laughs> it's about that time. It's about to go down. Getting after Jaws today. Getting this guy over here, John on a big shark. That's right, John's about to catch a big old shark Hopefully tonight. Hopefully it's gonna be a black tip, might be a spinner, or it could be a bull shark, which would be awesome because this is bull shark breeding ground. That's right, y'all. So shark fishing, it's about to go down. Christy and I, <laughs> we haven't done it yet this year. Probably gonna do a few more shark fishing videos uh, here to come. We've got prime sharking uh, conditions. <laughs> yeah. Low light. Uh, sun's about to go down like Christy was saying. Evening time, sharks come out. Chomp, 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 chomp. Shark bait number one. Shark bait number two. All right, Christy. Shark bait is going in the water. Okay. This one's free lining. Yeah. There you go. There you go. You're on. You're on. Let him take it. Let him take it. You're on. You're on. You are on, brother. Fight him. John's about to have the fight of his life. You on? Y'all, we just put out some chum and the bluefish. Not even two minutes later, he's already hooked up. Don't think it's a ray. Pretty sure it is a really good sized shark. And he is working back there, you guys. Look at that. This is a serious shark. All right, let's get up close so you guys can see all the action.
There he is. Dude. Let's see what we got. Oh, this yeah, is always like off. the coolest part is waiting for him to all of a sudden come up to the surface. Is that a good fight? Yeah, big <laughs> Wait for him to get around. Got that line. Dude. Nice. It's definitely not a stingray. <laughs> kind of scary thinking about how shark is. Oh, there she is. Whoa. <laughs> nice. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> Check nice out that butter. shark. What kind is it? I don't know. I don't think he's a black tip. Maybe it's a baby bull. Dang, he's trying to fix it up. Broke. Nice. Dang. You landed him. Oh. Later. Nice, John. <laughs> All right, y'all. So there it is. That is a, another day in the books. Chesapeake Bay fishing. Yep. One fish, two fish. That's right. Film coming at you. Beautiful sunset behind us. Check, Check it out, you guys. That out right there. But anyways, we're going to get up off the water and John right here put us on some awesome Spanish mackerel we've never trolled before. Trolling was awesome, but the best part was casting because that's what we're all about. Lures, casting. Yeah, had a lot of success too out there on the legit. water. It too was legit too legit. To quit. <laughs> Christy caught it. So, all right, y'all, that's it. Thanks for watching. If you guys got any requests for any other videos, catching cooks, all that junk, then leave us a line below. Yep, that's it. Peace out. Bye, you guys. Thank you.